Hello, hello, it's Thursday again. Uh, that means it's time for Thursday Lately's. Uh, this has been such a good week, just so fast. Like it does not even feel like it should be Thursday at all. So sorry this is going up kind of late on Thursday. Like I said, the week just got away from me. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, I do have a few things to share with you. And uh, the first one, I was, um, going to the store to go buy uh, some mascara and came across this one. I don't know if you guys have heard of this before, but it is Rimmel Glam Eyes. And this is, I've been really impressed with it. I, I don't know, I just got it, um, I think like Sunday maybe. Um, I, I'm kind of addicted to it now. I don't know, I love it, it's really good. Um, it has a lot of uh, volume and it also adds some length too. So. I don't know. It seems it seems like a really good one, but um, the actual mascara itself doesn't leave your eyelashes all um, crispy. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, I, but uh, that's what the brush itself looks like. Look at all those bristles. Like those those are some grabbers. Yeah, I don't know. So, I really like it. I don't know. It's just a good one. So if you're in the market for a new mascara, I really recommend it. Um, but like I said, it's Rimmel Glam Eyes, and I got a black, but, um, actually that's the only color that I saw with them. I don't know. But, yeah, I, I do really recommend it, though, if you guys are looking for some new mascara. And I want to say it was only, like, I don't know, $5.50 or something, which is not bad for a tube of mascara nowadays, so... I say nowadays, like I'm really old. I'm not. Uh, yeah. So anyways, um, second thing I want to share with you guys. I'm in a really slap happy mood. I'm sorry. I told you it's been a very long week. So, um, But the second thing that I want to share with you guys. A while back, Jake and I decided that we weren't going to uh, eat out as much as we were. We were going to a lot of restaurants. And we decided that we wanted to um, try to save back some of that money and actually, you know, cook at home more, me cook at home more, he eat more at home, so, but, um, I do like to cook, I, I do enjoy it, and I like getting to, um, have the satisfaction of knowing that, you know, I made something good, and everybody liked it, and I don't know, it just, it's a good feeling, so, anyways, this is a cookbook that I've had for probably a year now, I would say, but it's America's Most Wanted Recipes, and they're all from favorite restaurants. That's cool, right? And I can almost guarantee you that you're gonna recognize the majority of them in here. They have everything from Applebee's to Union Pacific. And they have Starbucks in here. Seriously, they have Starbucks recipes. Um, but what brought this up was whenever I was making out um, you know, like our grocery list, we were trying to come up with different stuff that we haven't had for a while for dinner instead of just making the same thing over and over. And I remembered that I had this cookbook and I dug it out and I've made quite a few things from it this week actually. And I've made, I've made a lot of recipes, yeah, a lot of the recipes out of it I've used. Nothing like half or anything like that because there's a lot of recipes in here. But I've definitely made enough to know that I like the book and to know that I want to recommend it to you guys. So yeah, if you're in the market for um, a new new cookbook, and I promise there's nothing in here that's like crazy, crazy difficult. Like they're not going to have you flambe anything. I have no idea how to flambe if that tells you anything. It's not in a cookbook, so don't worry about it. Um, but yeah, it is America's Most Wanted Recipes. It's by Ron Douglas. Good one. I really recommend it. So that's the second thing I want to share with you. Good food, right? Can't go wrong there. Um, the third thing that I want to share with you is Liz from uh, Craft to the Radio sent me this super cute necklace, and I wanted to share it with you guys. Check that out. Yeah, it's an old typewriter key. How cool is that? I love this necklace. I love, um, you know, vintage -y pieces. I can't talk. <laughs> and, uh... You know, anything that can be um, upcycled, I love stuff like that. Um, I like nods to 
kind of our retro lifestyle, you know, how things were, the slower paced life. Oh, slower paced life. What is that? <laughs> I wish that I had that. I love my cell phone, but God, I'm addicted to it. And sometimes I just want to throw it out the window. <laughs> just, just get away from it. Um, but yeah, so she um, sent me this necklace and I love this thing. Isn't that, isn't that cute? But I can picture it getting, um, you know, put with like a lot of different um, chains, um, different little um, charms and things like that. And, you know, different, different lengths. Probably one of the ways that I'm going to wear it. And I also love it just on its own. Isn't that cute? I love this necklace. Love it. So anyways, um, I just got it, I just got it this morning and as soon as I got it, I ripped the package open and put it on and I, I love it. I'm very happy with it. So thank you very much, Liz. Um, but that's all I have to share with you guys this week. Just those three quick things. Yeah, I told you it's been quick around here lately. Crazy fast life. So, um, and the sad part is, is I really don't even get that much done. I only get like half the to-do list done. Ugh. One day I will get caught up on everything, I promise. Um, so anyways, I'm going to link up to Liz below. And you guys really need to go check her out. You're going to love this girl. She's super, super sweet. And uh, definitely has a good eye. Yeah. So I will link up to her below. And that's it. That's all I have for you. So I hope you all have a good week. Yeah. Enjoy the uh, horribly rainy weather that we're having. Yes. It was so warm. Just a couple of weeks ago and now it's done. It's over. Gone. Now it's April showers. Ugh, bummer. So anyways, enjoy the rest of your week and I'll talk to you guys again next week. Okay. Bye.